everybody, welcome. Welcome, welcome. I think we are ready to proceed with another lesson of... I, I, I don't know, it feels weird to say to say lesson where it's a game, but yeah, you, you guys know what I mean. Welcome to another chapter, another lesson. Further improve of learn Japanese to survive Katakana War. Hello! Hey Kareike, do you want to carry on with our lessons? Uh, or do you need me for something? Um, well, that's an option. Study time. Study time. What do you want to do? I want to... Yeah. Lesson? Nice. First we should all get together and discuss what happened last time at the street mall. The mysterious woman and the giant Kitakana monster. To the classroom! But, but, but first of all... Can, can I do ASMR? Yeah. I didn't want to interrupt any dialogues. Well, this would have been the perfect moment, actually. Whatever. <clears throat> so, we all know what happened last time. We went out to exploring. <clears throat> Why does my microphone feel so loud? So extremely loud. We all know what happened last time. Uh, we went out exploring. The guy in Katakana Monster was unlike anything we've ever seen. Weird. That thing nearly kicked our butts. And just when I thought it was beat, I transformed into another shape. I can't think clearly about Katakana under the kind of pressure. Man, I can hardly remember my A to Z's, <laughs> even a good, on a good day. Owen! Jeez, Owen, give yourself some credit. You're not that silly. You remember to tie your shoes in the morning, right? You know. Yeah, of course I do. Oh damn, my shoes aren't tied. Uh, well, we got loose. We got through that encounter life. We should be thankful for our studies are paying off. Yes! Spot on. But we need to keep studying, in case we come across another gargantuan beast like that. Uh... Hey, what's the deal with that red-haired girl who approached us? She came out of the shadow like she'd been watching our little adventure. I'm not sure. That I cannot explain. I thought perhaps she was a foe, but if anything, she gave us a heads up on the danger approaching. I'm determined to find her again. I have more than a few questions, sir. Um... I have a feeling that she can find us if we keep going at our current pace. Seems like she has an interest in what's going on. I agree with Sia. We need to keep studying and clearing the city of Katakana monsters. When time comes, we want to enter the girl again. Right -o. It's settled then. We need to add the books. Can I take a snooze first? <laughs> Come on, can't we take a day off? No way! <laughs> Not chance, girl. You need to put in more studying than all of us. Yeesh. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> nothing, nothing. Well, I'll do my best. She thinks I'm an idiot. But I'm really smart and I prove it to all of you. Yes. I believe in your own. I believe in all of my students. Okay, full steam ahead. The lessons we're going to learn is a new set of Katakana characters. But before that, I got a treat of you for you. I'm going to teach you some Japanese vocabulary. Oh, nice. Good thing I have my books ready. Oh, my, my, my little... My little book? I, I don't know how to say it right now in English. So what are we learning? Are you excited to learn some Japanese vocabulary? The theme of this lesson is places. Ooh. Instead of just learning katakana every lessons, we are catching a look at, at new vocabularies. We cover 10 new words each lesson. What? I will demonstrate how to read and pronounce each word. Here's our first so you can get a feel for how the lessons Apato. work. Apato. There's a lot of info there. Let's break it down. Apato. The first line in blue is how to write the word in katakana. The katakana syllables we've already learned are colored in. Syllables we haven't learned yet are yet faded out. You don't need to worry about those yet. And the red text below is the English translation. So this fancy katakana word translates to apartment. Nice. Finally, the black text is on Archie. We want to use a system designed to transcribe Japanese sounds using the English, yeah, the English alphabet. Basically, it's let you read the word with zero Japanese knowledge. Machi is very common and there's a good chance you've come across it before. Words that are borrowed from Japanese use omaji. Think of words like tsunami, karaoke, sensei, etc. Omaji is super simple and easy to read. As you learn more katakana and gain an understanding of the syllables used in Japanese, you'll be able to write words in omaji as well as katakana. For the, yeah. For the vocabulary we are learning, you can use the omaji reading until we learn all of the relevant katakanas. Next, I discuss how to pronounce it properly. Apato. Apato. Did you hear well? The word is pronounced apato. Apato. You already know the first katakana, the word in the word a. 
So you have a good start on the pronunciation. The general rule of thumb when speaking Japanese is that the sound of syllables do not change, regardless of, of what syllables they followed. Yeah. Of what syllable they follow or proceed. We all know that English words can change pronunciation in strange ways. <laughs> and may not even be pronounced as they are written. However, in Japanese, every syllable has a specific pronunciation, and it's the same in every word it appears in. There are a couple of little exceptions, but nothing to be concerned with at this stage. Would you like to listen to the pronunciation again? Apato. Apato. Uh, where's my pen? There's go. Apato. Uh, uh, I, I really love foreign language words in Japan. Many of the words we will learn to write in katakana are words borrowed from other languages. A lot of them are from English, but some words are borrowed from other languages too. Words borrowed from other languages are written in katakana. Words that are in Japanese in origin are written in hiragana. These vocabulary lessons, we'll take a look at the mix of katakana words and hiragana words. We see hiragana words last. Don't worry if you don't understand hiragana. Everything will be translated for you. Okay, now you know how these vocabulary yeah, how these vocabulary lessons work. Let's look at our second word. Department store. Departo. Departo. Department. Store. Actually, you can a little bit confused what a department store is. Come here, German, they're huge. Is it a, something like a supermarket? Departo. Departo. Bombini. <laughs> Convenience store, that's uh, more like it. A combini. Convini. These are the super small stores you can find basically everywhere, which contain literally everywhere, I guess. Konbini. Especially in big cities like Tokyo, Osaka and Kyoto, they are really common. You can expect to see konbini on every street corner. Konbini. Ready for the next word? Hoteru. Hoteru. Ah. Hoteru is also a nice word. Sadly, I know a way way more uh, how to do words than I should. Then then it's good for my health. Tell. Hotel. Mm. Many hotels in Japan are built in a Western style, modeled after American and European hotels. If you're looking for traditional Japanese accommodation, you want to search for Ryokan. Hotel. Restaurant. Yep, that's also easy. Restaurant. What I really like in those uh, vocabularies is that they sound most likely this, nearly the same. Restaurant. Restaurant covers a wide variety of Japanese eateries, from fast food to high class venues. Restaurant. Okay, that's five words. Done. That covers all our katakana words in this lesson. Let's take a look at five words written in hiragana. Mi se. For these hiragana words, you see the hiragana characters are written in green. You'll be able to read these if you have played the previous game in the series or studied Japanese before. If you don't know hiragana, never fear. Just read the words using romaji written in black. Mise. Mise is Japanese for shop. Mise applies to most shops, small or large. Mise. 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 Kouen. 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 This is a little bit annoying that I can't block them the writing off somehow. K 
cool. And that's a park. This word refers to a beautiful park filled with trees and wildlife. Not be confused with the space to park your car. Ginko. Bank. I think I read this somewhere before also. But I'm not quite sure. Ginko. It's a bank. But the, the money bank. Not not, uh, not not a bank in a park. Ginko. No, that's a ginko to deposit or withdraw money. Ginko. Ginko. Bioin. Bioin. The hospital. Yo in This is an important word to know in case you ever find yourself needing medical treatment in Japan. I struggle reading uh these hiragana's when they are uh Combined with a uh, you, yeah, or yo. Because this this looks like a B followed by a U, and I would like B, B, U. Wait, it's a yo. My bad, it's a yo. <laughs> Whatever. But but the but they have, they they combined. You have, you know, you you read them a little bit differently. You binkyoku post office. You binkyoku. Post office. You binkyoku. This word is a mouthful. It's handy to memorize in case you want to send a postcard what's true. Trailing Japan. You been Kyoku. 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 I think I have it. Phew, that covers all of our hiragana with his lessons. Yep, he's right. Because of your hard work, you learned 10 new Japanese words. Give yourself a round of applause. <clears throat> that sounds always weird. I, I, I find clapping with hands sounds, sounds a little wrong. But could be just me sometimes. Uh, lips. Are you get up for your katakana lesson? We're launching into it right now. Just like our last lessons, the characters we will learn now represent syllables instead of single letters. This is also true for all of our upcoming lessons. Sa se shi su. Sa se. She su se. So, well, why why do I mix the se in there? So she su se so that's that's how it should sound be pronounced. Ah, there there it says the characters above are so she su se and so. They follow a vowel sound and order like usual. The only exception is she, which adds an h sound. I take you through these new characters one by one. Time to take the first one. Sa. Sa. Like in the word sa. Mm. Sa. Let's practice writing it. Ah, oh, damn, that looks literally similar to to what is it? To a sa shi su se. Is it a se in here again? Uh, straightforward, consisting of two straight lines and one curved. Sa. Sa. We start with this one. Go down and go down. Start with this one, go down and go down. Start with this one, go down and go down. Start with this one, go down and go down. Two straight lines and one curved. Watch writing again. Yep. 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 I don't feel like I'm drawing it very good, even I take my time. I think that last one is good. I think I'm happy with that one. Or maybe not. 
continue. She. She. Pronounce it as she, like in the word sheep. It's a smiley. She. <laughs> Every time I see she, I have to smile. Oh, God damn it. That's, that's cringy on some points. Nah, no, I don't. Put it in there. Make sure you'd rather set truck on the bottom going up. This is important, as it helps tell this character apart from a character you will learn later. She. Oops. What? Oh, I see. So we go like... I feel weird drawing this one, but that's okay. I think I, I think I can do this. Continue. So, so, so how can I? So, what's the following animation? So, we have this one and that thing in the corner. We have this one. And that thing in the corner. The first draw consists of the horizontal top line and the line curving down. Don't lift your pen until you complete the whole line. So go like tap, 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 tap. So. Hmm. I feel weird drawing these. I don't, I don't even have the feeling I draw them correctly. That, that totally feels weird. Say. I got the say looks like. Say looks even more like a say. Say. L like the hiragana say. So we have this one and then L. The first stroke should be angled sharply at the end, not curved. The second stroke has a gentler curve with it starts going around suddenly. God damn it. Say. Oh, we're gonna zap. This looks actually fine if I have if I place them right. I think I can't blame me for that one. Getting smaller, maybe I can blame me. Maybe I should throw this one a little bit like this. Uh, this feels weird. So. So, like in, in the word so da. So. So da. This is literally similar to she, but this character has one less stroke near to the top. However, you need to draw the long stroke from the top to bottom, unlike in... Oh, God damn it! Yeah! So we have one... And two... One... And two... Can I, can I watch writing again? One... And two... One... And two... Why is my mobile phone... <laughs> I don't know, one more time. I think I, yeah, this should be uh, sufficient enough. Congratulations, you're near five new Katakana characters. You're getting good at this. Since you're becoming a pro, I want to show you what happens when we add Dakuten marks on these new characters. Yes, oh, this is a long lesson. Not gonna lie. Remember this little character, the dark curtain can be added to sa, she, su, se, and so. To make the syllables into Z sounds instead of S. I go through them all individually because one of these is not like the others. Za. Za. Pronounce it as za, like in the middle of the word with za. Write za as normal, then a dark curtain mark like above. Za. No. G. G. 
Oggi. Oggi, oh, it's not a z, z syllable. It's exception on this set. So I remember well. Pronounces G like I'm the name Jeeves. Right. She is normal than a deck with marks like above. Yeah, okay. G. 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 Zoo. Zoo. Pronounce it as zoo like in the word zoo. <laughs> right. Zoo is. Right, Sue as normal, then a tycoon marks a like above, god damn it. Zoo. Ze. Ze. Like in the word Zen. Like, C as normal, then a tycoon marks a like above. Ze. Ze. Next, so. this is Zo. Pronounce it as Zo, like in the word Zone. Zo. Zone. Yeah. Right, so as normal, then a tycoon mark like above. Zo. So. And I think that's it, yeah. We finished the set. You're a superstar. You obtained study guide 3. Use this from the items menu to quickly reveal those lessons. And achievement unlocked. Lessons cleared 3 out of 10. Now that the lesson is finished, let's have a short quiz to test what you learned. Question 1. What is this character? I give you all a moment to think about it. I will always do that now. I, I try to remember doing that all the time. But it's kind of obvious that we don't have Dark marks. So it's either the first or the third one. To be honest, I'm kind of confused right now. So she... Sue, right? Yeah. What is this character for? Yeah. This is kind of obvious again. Uh, oh, this is more obvious for me than the first one. We have Dakotan, so it's only the first or the second one. And it's basically the... Last one we learned, so and and we have zoo before. Got, we had zoo before, so it's obvious that it looks different, like, completely different now. What is this character? Come on. Yeah. Well, I got confused by myself, but um, we don't have dark curtains again, so it's not the G. And. Um, that basically left she or she in the end, and it's obvious that it's she. For, for me, it's obvious. What is the character for the syllable C? God damn it. That was one of those who looked similar to um, she. I think it was uh, the second one that we had. The second one is uh, it, it's it doesn't have dark curtains, so it's either the middle or the lower one. And uh, don't want to spoil everyone, but uh, it's definitely the last one. And the character for this syllable is Sa. We we don't have dark curtains, so let's drop that one here again. So we have the middle and the lower one, and it's the uh, middle one. The other one should be the C and the C. Z. God damn it. Yeah, then the world is off break. After our lessons, you're welcome to look around town at your leisure. We'll explore and keep my for out for any Katakana monsters that I'm not recognize. If you can defeat Katakana monsters in the city, we can unblock access to other areas and slowly reclaim Osaka. Here's the hint I saw Katakana monsters that look like the characters we just learned. They're hanging around the southeast side. Blocking access to the warehouse. Go defeat them and we can access the warehouse. Get going, champion. I don't think we have any new quests in here. I, I want to definitely save again. Uh, what's your uh, way through the park? Down here in the middle. No. We have a parking lot in here. What's this one south east? Oh, so this one's south east. Interesting. Ah uh, jeez. Um let's let's think. We have a start to begin with.
Oh, they have poison. That's bad. So let's remove the stuff first. I said let's remove the sa first. And after that we can clear out the... Well, I want to remove the one with the poison. Uh, it should be the zoo. Now oh, come on! Nice miss. They do a lot of damage, and this is really annoying. Now we're gonna eliminate the G because it's smiling at me. And I'm still a little bit too slow, it's a little bit annoying. And last but not least, we have uh, C. I nearly do any damage against these ones. Oh, never mind. Maybe it's based on the character and how much damage I deal them. Ooh, level up. <coughs> the enemies were defeated. The peasant of the wares is now open. Uh, items equip. Really, you're fighting with a cookbook? Nice. Uh, let's go back anyway real quick. I think I want to recover real quick. Welcome home. some great kind of amount of damage but we're gonna solve the warehouse conflict here and then I think it's time for to break take a break I don't want to rush this game since it's literally a learning game I don't think I can fight against any of the uh, K hero gunners anymore warehouse Hmm, is this place really empty? It was guarded by Kataka and Oman, so surely there's something here, right? <sighs> you again. What do you seek here? Ah, it's you. Yes. Yes, I repeat myself. What do you seek here? We cleared up the Kataka and Oman's guarding this warehouse and figured we'd best take a look inside. Mm. There's nothing for you here. Leave at once. But. If you insist on exploring this world, be on guard for the large Obaka. The large Obaka? Yes. The large ones will tear you to shreds. I hate to have to clean up after you. Take this book, maybe it will help you. Maybe not. Huh? What is this That's book? Strange. Look at the writing on the cover. It's in English, strange enough. Oh, you're right. It says, An Apprentice Guide to Magic. Magic? No way. No way. Could it be? I've read tales of this book. I always thought it was just make-believe, but you're holding it right now. Kraiko, this could really help us. We could learn to use magic to fight against the Katakana monsters. Taisuke, you're so funny. Magic isn't real, right? I'm not well, sure. I don't think so either. But think about it. Until recently, did you believe monsters were real? I never did. Yet, we've been fighting them constantly. Makes a sink, doesn't it? Gather round. Everyone, let's take a moment to gather around and read this book. With a bit of patience, we might learn how to cast magic spells in the battle. So, you learn Bolt and Souls, Dice Gillen, Stone Shard, Souls, Antox Antitoxin and Energize, Tear and Gale, Oven and Firebomb, Charlotte and Hailstone, Zeus, Antitoxin and Energize, and Rayon and Moonlight and Zeus. God damn it. Right I feel like I'm. This doesn't make anything better. I want to move myself. I 
think I have the hang of this. Me too. Make you pretty confident about this. Get ready. We should test our magic spells on the next unsuspecting monsters that want us by. And right on time. Yeah, perfect. Oh, <laughs> come on. Ah appears and sa appears. Press enter to click to continue. Select the spell from the list to cast an MP magic points and list. This list of next to it. Be sure to read magic spell description carefully. Each spell has a different effect. Some spells will damage our enemies, other spells can heal our body. Always remember, magic can cause damage, but it can never kill your foes. Weaken enemies with magic and then finish them off by attacking us down so they are weak too. Let's go! Hurl a powerful lightning bolt hits one enemy for major, for major damage. Magic causes damage but can't kill foes. Restore small amount. Okay, this is interesting. Ooh, that's that's nice. Stone shard, exploding stone. It's one enemy. It's one enemy. feeble, whatever feeble is. Stone shard is probably another attack, right? Oh, it's survived. That's what do we have, Gale? It's one enemies. Oh. Here we have my one hit one. Okay, so basically they all have an attack, which deals super low damage, except for my main character somehow, which does basically more attack with a simple attack. Normal attack feels much stronger. If I'm gonna be honest. Well done! Oh, you handled that very well. From now on, let's use magic spells to our advantage in combat. To look out more spells books on our journey, I'm sure we can learn even more powerful magic. For now, we should continue exploring this well. I want to track down the mysterious woman. She seems to know something we don't. Let's go. Challenge begin. Locate the mysterious woman. <laughs> the door's locked. Aww. I actually wanted to go a bit in between there, but I think I can't. One, tap out of here. Ah, uh, misclicked, okay. Oh, let's go down here. Where do I get the feeling this place isn't actually a warehouse? Feels more like a research lab, maybe? It doesn't sit well with me. Okay. Hold on. It's a T sound, so it's supposed to be and let, let's fight off the um, the she first the she and then the su first the she she miss nice and then we eliminate the zoo wait what uh the yeah yeah my bad the su Oh wait, I didn't pay attention. It's a C. Because it looked even more like a C. That was it. Damn. C. And the last one is, um, uh, what was it? Is it an C? Or uh, was it? It looks like a T. But is it a T or is it a T? I think it's an I sound, right? Yeah, nice one. Always keeping on the left side of the wall. Uh, they are both from the S syllables. So we start with a Z, a G. Let's let's start with a G. G. Wait, what? Ah, oh, crap, it looks like a G, but it's actually the zoo. My bad, my bad, totally my bad. Venomous ink. I don't like that poison attacks. And the other one is a Sa. No, no, I have it. Definitely going to name myself when I return to this 
when, when, when I enter the Japanese study course. They do a lot of damage and I definitely don't like that. It doesn't really feel like my normal attacks are stronger than my magic against this one. Maybe I changed that one. Level up, nice one. And a crystal shard. Oh, it goes up here again. Then I'm here on the left side. Okay, this is interesting. Not what I expected, but still interesting. Oh, and this returns enemies. Okay. So, we fought this guy before, but this time it's not a... Uh... Andrea is the wee one, right? Yeah. Oh, misclicked. And uh, this one is a soup. We're making progress. We're learning, we're learning. Learning by doing. That's the best practice. I really like this game. I'm not gonna walk to the right and fight this far on the right again. Maybe on the way back. Okay, we have two from the S syllables, and I think the middle one is from the K syllables. Let's finish off the uh, so first. So. And after that, we follow with its with the C. So. God damn it! Come on, do a little bit more damage, please. So. Damn it! Okay, time to try out some magic, which I don't have. I'm pretty sure this looks like a key. It, it looks similar to a key, so I shouldn't. Be, I should be able to identify it. It has. Dark Woodens. My bad, totally my bad, that's fine. Obtained leather jacket, nice. Uh, equip. Optimize. Optimize. Okay, here, here, here doesn't have many things. Um, Skills. Can you heal yourself, please? Nice one. That should be enough. Uh, let's go left. Uh, God damn it, this one is a she, because she is always smiling. She. And the other one is a... Please tell me you do at least good amount of magic damage. Actually, yes. So you're more of a ma magician. Explains your large amount of MP. Um, I kind of don't like it. But I think I have to work with that one then. Um, the other one was... Uh, so... So... Obtained serum two, three times. Expected a little bit more armor, sadly. Another chest on this side. And coffee. Kohi. Kohi ga arimasu ka. Okay, now this one's uh, a savage one, kinda easy. I already figured it out finally. I'm still gonna attack with moonlight on the. Tsu. So just do more damage like this. You can finish him off. I think I get the hang on it. And then we're gonna eliminate this guy. What? Ah, uh, I thought it's a zoo. Why? Why don't I? My my mouse says something different, but my my mind acts completely different. My mind acts. My mind says the right thing, 
but my buddy uses the wrong whatever. Uh, let's go with... Uh, let's eliminate she first. No offense. She. Oh. And here we go, off with the... Uh, so. And that was the wrong attack, whatever. Not too late. So. Hmm. <laughs> Miss. Ah, damn it, that was my table. So. Do I want to go up already? If I go up, I have to fight again, right? But let's explore the area first. Uh, that's a, definitely an I. So we're gonna eliminate she first and then we're gonna she. attack C. She. Nice one. We're getting stronger. Stronger makes the game easy. Let's see. Um, skills, equip, skills, equip, skills, equip, skills, equip. Skills. Magic. Oh wait. Uh, magic. Since Andrea is the one who's only useful with magic, there she is. Revive two times. I'm gonna go back real quick. I wanna see what's up here before I go and encounter that girl. Let's. Uh, uh, so. And this is a. Uh, Za. Za. Whatever. And this. That's a little bit strong. So. Sa. 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 Yod. Oh, 27 damage. This is actually fine. Sa. Pick a switch. Steel rod. Okay. I have to fight against this one here again, and it's running away. Interesting. Didn't it? Just, haven't it seen me? Interesting. Or is that just because I already fought that one? And it like, no, I don't want to fight these guys anymore. That was uh, too. Just to clarify, I, I, I don't want to hear anything like, yeah, you know, you're magic since you don't know the katakanas. Just more strategically, since she's weaker with normal attacks. I can avoid unnecessary fights and take a look what we have here. Oh. Okay, this is now getting interesting. We fight with. We eliminate the zoo first. That's not the say. What, what am I doing? Magic. Well, I wouldn't have eliminated him anyway. No, I think it was an O. Because it looks like an O. No, it's not. Okay, okay, it's not an O. Uh, then it's a Q. I, I remember it looks like a... I, I I don't know why. Yeah, it's it's all, it's cool. I just thought that square. That square look. Can you, go? Oh dear, someone is here. I worked at this lab, but I've got invaded by those monsters. Have you seen them? They're out of control. Two strange-looking women came by this morning. They said they were hunters. 
He had to take care of the monsters. I didn't know whether to trust him. But any chance to get rid of the monsters sounded good. I guess in special clearance to the top floor of the lab so they could fight all the monsters. Could you go, for, go look for the two women to see if they complete their hunting task? Here, I give you a copy of the same card key. You can use this to unlock the large white door on the ground floor near the entrance. You'd have seen it when you came in. Please find those two hunters and see if they're okay. What's more difficult? Talk to her. E1, E2, another dead end. Brass knuckles, ooh. Okay, I can't double loot them. Equip brass knuckles. Is, uh, I think I don't. Is, is, is it Owen who fights with that one? Oh, steel rod. Nice. And a jacket. Okay. Not exactly what I wanted, but uh, still fine, I guess. Let's fight my way back. Uh, that's a G. G. Uh, that's definitely. Ah, uh, only has one stroke. Yeah, yeah, it's only has one stroke. My bad. Do the other one is it the Hiragana, the Katakana K? Something similar to the Hiragana K? So. Gonna try it out. Ka. Yeah, that's that's good to learn. If they look similar to a Hiragana, then it's most likely the Katakana of it. And this one was supposed to be the Zo since only has one stock. <laughs> yeah, here same same here with the key. key. And there we go. Uh, take was with magic. Let me let me sure take a moment to think about it. So uh, uh, two. Here we here see it clear. A she was two strokes. And a uh, Zo. That we attack was magic, by the way. Was one. Nearly so. mixed it up. Ye what? How? How did I fail that one? I want to avoid unnecessary fights at Gigturly again. Okay, we have a set and a zoo. One character, damn it. Of course it survives. Shit. And uh is it Venomous Ink. It doesn't look like I'm good poisoned in here. Do. Nice level ups. Mm. I'm gonna take a short break. Like, um, not, 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 not here on stream. Uh, I wish there was some passageway to go through here. That I don't have to run across the whole city, you know. I want to take a short, short rest. That's that's the battles. We have to scrap back to a situation.
um, warehouse is down here. And then we go up here again. Uh, let's go with the she again. I'm making progress here. I wish I would could also fight. Whoops. Uh, the others, like uh, 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 U, A, and O, or K, Q, and K. I think I fought some of. I think I fought K. But you're not. Also, you're my magic character. One moment. Sorry for that. I've got interrupted for a moment. Um, this was a uh, set. Set. Now we can eliminate the e. E. Easy as it is. I expected to fight some stronger enemies in here. Warehouse lab. Oh, already. Unbelievable. You actually went out for your way to gain access to this lab, then you followed me here. What exactly are you trying to prove? Mm -hmm. We've got interest in you. Specifically, why you seem to know so much about the Katakana monsters that have invaded the city? Hey, yeah, why do you know so much? Are you are you evil? No. No. <laughs> it doesn't even matter if you're evil or not. What we want to know is why did the Katakana monsters suddenly start taking Osaka? Mm. I don't know the answer to that. Maybe Satomi does. Satomi. Who is that? <sighs> I've said enough. Just know that I'm not a threat for you. But the large Obaki creeping up behind you certainly is a threat. Sorry for this. Overlord appears. He makes a double strike on two characters, or a single strike on two characters. Um, that's a obvious character to fight with. It's actually kind of weak, but the thing about it is that it's evolving, and I absolutely have no idea what character this is one. Um, it's either Go or Ge. Good. Yeah, it's good. Oh, 50 50 chance. Good. Now we have a sun. Do you take two time my magic magician? That's kind of rude. Uh, it's a G, but it's obvious. D. I'm not making progress here. D. Come on. Um, that's a zoo. And another one. Oh, come on. Um, it's an O or an E. Is it E? E. No. And it's uh, ooh. Uh. Uh. As if you're still alive, come on. Uh. Level up, nice one. I'm impressed. You dealt with a large Obaka with little trouble. 
What are you talking about? That was a whole lot of trouble, not thanks to you. We nearly got our bugs kicked, but you hid behind your laser shield thingy. It's all okay now. Oh, it's all okay now. Calm down. Yeesh. Yeah, yeah. We caught that monster Obaka. What does that mean? No, Do you truly not know be. what you've been fighting against all this time? No, it cannot be. Hmm. Listen, you might not trust me. But I show you our goals are the same. I want to destroy the back as much as you do. You've proven yourself capable on several occasions. I think I can share some information with you. But this is no place for such talk. Do you have a safe place we can discuss this? Yes! Our <laughs> classroom at the school is safe for the time being. Thank you. Then let us meet you there tomorrow. I tell you oh. what I know. Very well. I'm not sure I trust you, but at the moment we are fighting blind. We need to know our enemy Farewell. better. Farewell then. Until tomorrow. I don't really trust her either, Daisuke. I see. I know. We have to be on our guard. Let's eat home and rest up. Tomorrow should prove interesting. Come talk to me outside the school when you want to proceed. Nice one. Phew, what a day. Ah, uh, here's, here's the, the apartment. apartment. You there. I, feel... I know what you've been up to. Hmm? Us? Who else? I saw you leave that abandoned warehouse. Abandoned? Tell me. Was it as cool as it looks? I can't believe there's an actual abandoned warehouse in the city. That's so wicked. With all these monsters crawling around, I can just imagine the warehouse is some evil villain's lair. The skies are clouded with fog. A group of heroes emerge from the warehouse's secret lab. The mad villain has been defeated, and the city returns to peace once more. Then, an epic guitar solo kicks in. Yeah. It's so cool. Who are you? What's your problem? Or what something like that. What are you talking about? Whoa, my bad. Got carried away there. I'm Misha. I just saw you guys leave that warehouse with a triumphant look on your faces. My imagination got a bit carried away. Uh-huh, you're not actually far from the truth. A fairly epic battle just went down. I knew it! <laughs> you have to give me all the deets. You guys are so cool. Are you fighting to save the city? Yep, we sure are. And we're winning. Unreal. I knew someone would be fighting these monsters. I kicked their butt myself, but I can't figure out how to hurt them. Well, it's kind of a long story, but we figured out that knowing Japanese can help defeat these monsters. So I'm teaching all these guys how to speak Japanese. My name's Daisuke. Whoa. So good to meet you all. Like I said, I'm Misha. I'm an exchange student. Came all the way from Russia. Since these monsters attacked, school's been out. Not complaining, though. Gives me more time to shred on my guitar. I tried fighting those monsters once or twice, but couldn't even hit them. Wouldn't have thought you needed to know Japanese to win. Hey, since I've got some free time now, can I join your class? I want to take part in these epic battles with you guys. Of course. It will be pretty dangerous, though. Are you trying to scare me off, Daisuke? That's adorable. I'm probably braver than you. Well, we can find out. Welcome to the team. <laughs> yes! <laughs> well, I'm not gonna let you join me. <laughs> uh, of course, on one point, what an adventure. I should rest up before continuing with more lessons. The thing is, uh, well, actually, the rest is not a bad idea right now. The thing is, I need to raise my affection level with each character. And as long as I have these. Well, as long as I have these three down here, I'm not gonna let them. As long as I'm busy with these three, I'm not gonna let them join me. So let's hear some faction Hello. events. Good to see you. Let's go somewhere and chat. Da -da -da. Woo, off we go. Oh, hey, it's you. Yeah, we just said we get down to chat somewhere. Get this. I finally managed to order a coffee in Japanese, and they made it just the way I like it. Daisuke's lessons are really helping me out. Not only are we learning heaps, we're also kicking serious butt. I think I missed out something, but when did he teach us coffee? Hey, uh, you want a coffee as well? I'll order you one. It's a piece of cake. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. Increase by 20. Uh, actually, it's pretty late. The cafe is probably closed. My bad. Um, 
while I've got you here, can I tell you something? I really appreciate you backing me up in that last battle. If it wasn't for you, I would have been toast. You really saved my hide. So, thanks. You're welcome. I want to make it up to you somehow. Oh, I know. I'll get you a gift. What I do like you gifts. Like? Uh, books? Clothes? Games? All of them? I collect cute little teddy bears. I'll get you one of those. It will be perfect. Uh, that's something I don't collect, but in yeah, fine. That looks just like you. Wait, what? Oh my gosh, it's gonna be amazing. Okay, I'll have it for you next time. Please look forward to it. I see you soon. Yeah, see you soon. She had a great day with you. She has received the boost to her stats. Hmm. Da, 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 da. Sweet treats! You should swing by the pet scissory. My treat. Yes. That was just a ruse to spend time with you. Got you now. Hello, my dear strawberry cupcake. How are you on this wonderful day? You're uh, too friendly. Rather well myself. Too full of sweet words. I'm just working on my brand new cooking TV show. Yep, yep, yep. It's coming to a TV network near you. Next time on Andrea's Kitchen, we'll learn how to make a super swell lemon tart with extra lemons. Psst, the secret ingredient is lemons. <laughs> oh, now that you're here, I have a question for you. Do you like cooking or baking or eating? <laughs> Food sucks. <laughs> I love all of those things. Uh, I always be frankly, that gives me the most affection, apparently. Well, my zesty blueberry crumble, have I got news for you. Jeez. Oh, you are going to star alongside me on TV in Andrea's kitchen. I've already made up my mind, so you don't have a choice in the matter. Okay, Aziz? Fine. There's just one problem, though. At this point, the TV show only exists in my head. So you've got to help me make it a reality. In return, I'll make you a dozen apple pies, and they'll be the best darn apple pies you've ever tried. We have a deal, right? Yippee! Well, I'll see you next time, when we return with the premiere of Andrea's Kitchen. She has received a boost to her stats. Nice one. Oh, Daisuke Sensei! Wait, what? Hello! Ah, oh, 300 and 500, okay. Um. Wait, how many do I need? Fine, and what do I need with crystal shots? Come on, for special items. Time to power up. Nice one. Achievement unlocked. What else do we need? Eight hidden achievements. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's R7. So what's the last one? Does it finish the game? The true area, probably. There we go. Some sort of terrifying monster lurking around the street mall. It's supposed to have 13 heads and 22 tails. Oh, our rain. Only there was someone. Okay. Objectives. Oh well, you could take care of that monster. That's one of our news. You can find some monster roaming around the street mall. When you defeated it, come back here and I give you a reward. Street mall, street mall, street mall. Uh, doors locked. This is a weapon shop, right? Actually, my umbra is nowhere to be found. It's not raining now, but we'll, we'll lay down. How can I forget it? Can you please run on the convenience store for me and pick up a new umbrella? 
Time to learn some more words before we finish this. Before you take a short break, I sent you it. Thank you. You can usually find umbrellas for sale in any convenience store. I'll be here waiting. Well, I want to go down anyway. It looks like I have no more side quests here to do. The park lady also doesn't have one, right? Oh, there she is. Yeah. And this is the place where I just came from. So if I can't pass through between these trees. Wow. Whoops. Only two side quests. Should be the hotel, I guess. Everything's it's instead empty here. Do I have a list of my side quests? Let's go in here first. Oh, hi, Yukazamas. What would you like to buy? Umbrella. Glorious fashion album. For a lot. It's not part of my team, okay. I don't know, I feel like I wanted to have one. Wait, I think I know where do I have to go. On the shopping mall somewhere here. Saka Street Mall, yeah, that looks that looks good. That's a call. Cool. I one-shot them at least. That's a gi. Except with Andrea. Gi. Expected. Then we have a ka. Ka. And another gi. Gi. Why are they so aggressive? Uh, that's a E. e. On E. And that's a Q, which I don't get one shotted. E. Should have switched up that text. Maybe Andrea could have one shotted the E. Whatever. E. At the street mall. At the street mall. Which which street mall? I'm in Osaka Street Mall, yeah. Uh, that was a Q and a K E. E. Ah, close, close. E. Felt like it was one step away from attacking me. Ki. Ki. Go. Go. And one more go, come on. Go. Ah, here we have this. Found you. This looks, uh, this appears to be the monster you're looking for. Defeat it, then return to town and turn in complete quest. This looks kinda easy, but there's something a bit fishy about it. 
that it's a amount of life it has. That should be the good. It's a gar, my, my bad, my bad, totally. Uh, I was I was daydreaming. Easier this is. Got a few minutes. I can teach you some Japanese words, specifically if you teach, I teach you some adjectives. Let's get right into it. Subarashi. Subarashi. Wonderful. Let's give my notebook, uh, my my vocabulary book, a few more intros. Subarashi. Wonderful. Can be used to describe something as wonderful, splendid, marvelous, excellent, CC. Subarashi. This means wonderful in Japanese. Oishi. Oishi. Delicious. Oishi. Delicious. Yum, 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 yum. Delicious. This word can be used broadly to describe food or drinks that are tasty or enjoyable. Oishi. Oishi means delicious. Oishi. Atarashi. Atarashi. New. Atarashi. New. This is what describes something that is brand new. Example Atarashi Fuku. New clothes. So we're gonna write down Fuku too. As clothes. We bring out the maximum out of it. Okay, it's big. And she is small. Furu is old. This can be used to describe anything that's big or large, such as an item or an animal. But it's not the same as saying tall. Okay. Okay. This means small. Touch yourself. She sigh small. This can be described anything that's small or little, such as an item or animal. Although it's not the same as saying short. Rock on, superstar. Quest cleared. That's all the words I have for you. Here's a small reward for your trouble. Chain more. Obtain four bonus points. Come to see me again if you want to reveal this word. Definitely need to prepare to the maximum and then I can go like yep and yep and yep okay nothing changed oh you actually got me an umbrella this is embarrassing I found my one I'm really sorry for making you go buy that please you can keep it let's stick to my promise though I'll teach you some Japanese words for any items let's get right into it Kasa. Kasa. umbrella Nearly wrote it down with the set. You can stand under my casa, 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 ah, 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 ah. This is horrible. Casa. Continue. Caban. Caban has a bag. Oh, that's interesting. That's something I didn't know. Caban. Bag. 
refers to handbags, briefcases, etc. Kami. Kami. That's something I knew. This paper. Kami. Kaitai Denwa. Kaitai Denwa is the cell phone. I knew Kaitai. And I also know the word Denver and Singularity, but not combined. A new Ketai was uh, the word for phone or mobile phone. But I'm more used to a smartphone uh, also, and because of an uh, Isekai anime. Smartphone to Tamonini. Just to sell on mobile phones only, not traditional telephones. Kaitai Denwa. Rock on Superstar. Easy peasy. That's all the words I have for you. Here's a more reward for your travel. You can see me again if you want to reward these words. Hello! Yeah, come on. I won't gain one level, but I think that it was wasted since I didn't get an achievement out of it. So we're gonna save here and uh, finish it. So thanks everyone for watching so far. I'm gonna take a short break and be right back. <laughs>